several people from work were, were, were wanting to introduce me to women and uh, each time I was severely underwhelmed. It was like, really you're introducing me to that person? I'm like, your impression of me is I'm here? It, it, it just didn't work. John Francis, trick question for you. Yes. Match guarantee. Are you crazy <laughs> to spend <laughs> that kind of money to meet? How many ladies did you meet? Eleven. And there were more options. <laughs> <laughs> so was it worth it? Totally worth it because uh, you're, you guys are screening. So we're, you're, you're eliminating uh, the wheat from the chaff, if you will, <laughs> for, for those of you who, who know about uh, farming. Uh, yeah, it's, uh, it sort of eliminates some risk for me because I, I, I was here before previously. And, you know, I can tell you that if you have a bad agency or if you have uh, or if you're doing it on your own, you have a very, very high chance of, of, uh, of falling on, you know, women who are in it for money, just for money, just for gifts and everything like that. And you just eliminate the, 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 the gold diggers. And I know you guys for a fact, you know, you, you get rid of them when you see that, uh, that, that they're trying to play a game, you know, trying to scam. So, yeah, it's worth it. And uh, the, the, also the quality of the women, I can say, you know, all, all the women I've met without exception have been intelligent. Uh, educated, uh, they they have a high level of culture. They all, everyone, I've, literally everyone I've met has wanted to learn. They ask a lot of questions about you know how things are in Canada. Uh, they'll talk to you about politics. They'll talk to you about sports. They'll talk to you about everything. It's 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 a huge difference. I mean, why not why not do that? I mean, if ran, random girl in the street, you know, you have no idea what, what, what's her education level. What what what's she going to be able to talk to? You? How long have you been dating in Canada to find the right one? You know, for serious love and marriage. Mm -hmm. How long have you been dating and been unsuccessful? Well, um, several people from work were, were wanting to introduce me to women and uh, each time I was severely underwhelmed. It was like, really you're introducing me to that person? I'm like, your impression of me is I'm here? It, it just didn't work, you know, and, I, and it's not even an age issue because I've, I'm fine with dating someone my age as long as she looks good, you know, I think I look good. I don't want someone who's 55 and looks 60, you know, or, or something like that, and I, I don't want that attitude either, so there was that. Um, and I tried the different uh, apps, but um, I'm not a superficial person and also, sadly, I'm not photogenic. I'm the opposite of photogenic cameras hate me. I had absolutely no success with those things. There was practically no answer rate and, you know, unfortunately or unfortunately, depending on who you are, um, there's a game to play, you know. I've talked to women friends and they've told me, yeah, there's an expectation. You have to talk a certain way and you have to bullshit and you have to play this game and then you have to act like that and then you have to pretend you're not interested and then you have to wait and I'm like, seriously, I have to go through all these hoops just to, just to get a date? <laughs> and after that, more hoops just to get a second date and, and, and all of that. And it, it, it just, it, for me, it was just aggravating. It, it's, it's, it's a waste of time. So I, on and off, you, since you asked me, I, on and off, I tried for several years, like for three, four years, on and off, you know, being introduced to people, uh, going on, uh, I even tried Tinder, but you know, Match, Match.com, not MatchGRT, Match.com. I tried all of the stuff and it was very, very disappointing. Very disappointing. I, I did not have one good experience in those years trying. So uh, going back to the previous question, yeah. It's, so, you know, if it's like, oh, you're going to pay a, a, an amount of money, but you, you're guaranteed to meet people who are interested in meeting you because they test to see if you're into, their, the leads are interested. And all of them were, you know. I, I had to decide who I was interested in, so it's it's night and day. It's really night and day. I'm in week two. I'm in my second week, and I'm already going to uh, to Elena's hometown. So, and I'm meeting her family, and uh, she's basically said she's interested. She just wants to see if I'm for real. So, so the, the opposite happens too. We have to see if they're for real, and she wants to see that I'm for real. She's like, you're too good to be true. So she she said that to me. So, yeah. To contrast, look, I told you three, four years, I was, I was looking on and off, so let's say two years constant, and here in two weeks I got more results than I got in two years <laughs> in Canada. So, it says a lot, right? <laughs>
as it takes until you find the one. Ukraine, a lost world of beautiful traditional women. At last, a place where you can find the beautiful wife you have always dreamed of. Every Ukrainian woman dreams of having a happy family. Now you can have a traditional beautiful wife from Ukraine, creating happy family memories forever. So what are you waiting for? Register right now and Skype our beautiful ladies completely free. So what makes us different, you might ask? Why not ask Google simply by searching Match Guarantee Reviews.